when you're actually donating, there's two things that are going to happen. We're going to put this blood pressure cuff on your arm, and it's going to keep pressure on your vein to keep it dilated, to make sure that we can still get a blood flow. And then we're going to have you hold this hand gripper. During the donation, it's good to squeeze it every three to five seconds or so, or do a continuous roll. This makes sure that your blood stays steady and that you'll finish in the time limit, which is 15 minutes. If you keep a nice rolling and squeezing motion, you shouldn't have any problem with finishing. For a whole blood donation, we have digital scales that weigh each unit of blood. Here's one of them here. So we would put our blood bag on the scale like this. So what this scale is going to do, it's going to rock back and forth. There's an anticoagulant in this bag that we want the donor's blood to mix with to make it make sure that there's no clots. So when we start, it rocks back and forth like this, and then on the top it has a digital readout of how much it weighs at any time. The collection goal for this is 565 grams. Now that's including the bag weight, so it's about uh, 475 grams of blood, or one pint of blood. When it's done, and it hits 565, it's going to ring and clamp. So then we know... Then we know when the donor's finished.